Hello guys, this is Pearl and today I am super and overly excited to give you a tutorial on how to increase conversions by designing a user-friendly navigation. And we are going to use two studies to back this tutorial. So let's quickly get started to know how you can design a user-friendly navigation and also increase conversion with that user-friendly navigation. Let's get started. If you really want to design or create a user-friendly navigation that automatically increases conversion, then one of the most important things you need to consider is to add multiple navigations as one, especially if it's for an e-commerce website. This is very important because when you add multiple navigations as one, it gives your site visitors or your site viewers a variety of options they can use or they can choose from just to look for a specific item or product on your website. And once things are very easy, or once the, the, your navigation is very easy and it gives your website visitors options they can choose from just to search for a specific product it is going to be very user friendly and this will automatically increase conversions on your website now there's a study to back this up and in this study it shows a website that use multiple navigation which is three different navigations as one and it's drastically increased conversion by 18.5 percent in a short period of time now this research or this study was conducted by prince globe and the link to the study is in the description below you can click on the link to have access to the full study according to the study prince globe was very poor in conversion or prince globe was not doing well in conversions at all so they decided to change their navigation because that was where the problem was coming from they used three different navigations and let's look at the end results and let's find out which navigation helped them convert better by 18.5 percent let's get into this this is the first navigation print globe used and this is a grid navigation so the first thing they tried was to use a grid only navigation just to see if it will increase conversions now as you scroll you can see that all the products or all the items are in the grid form or in the grid viewed and this navigation didn't increase conversion at all it didn't increase conversion or it didn't add up to conversions at all so prince globe decided to change from the grid only to something else let's look at the second thing they tried and let's see whether it yielded results or not this is the second navigation prince globe decided to try out and this navigation is left nav and also the grid so they joined the left the left navigation and grid and this didn't yield results as well or this didn't increase conversions as well so you can see right here that this is a left navigation which gives the site visitor an opportunity or the option to just skip and choose search for something specific they are looking for and also shows them the product now when you combine the left navigation and also the grid it didn't help at all and it also didn't increase navigation or it didn't move navigation as they expected so they decided to try something else let's look at the third thing they tried this is the third navigation Prince Globe decided to try out. So they added multiple navigation. The first one was the grid only, which you can see right here. So this is the grid. So they added grid and they combined the grid with the left navigation and also carousel right here. So this shows the items in a grid view alongside with the navigation plane, which is the next navigation and also the carousel. So the carousel options allows the customer to click the right arrow, which is right here from the grid. So this is the grid. They click the right arrow from the carousel, which is right here. And this gives them the chance to view the items within a particular category. So if a customer is searching for something on sleeves, all the customer has to do is to click on sleeves, which is right here now once you click on sleep it brings you to the grid and when you click on the grid or once you are onto the grid you can decide to scroll through the carousel to search for a specific sleeve you are looking for and this was good this multiple navigation or this three navigation combined together as one really helped prince globe to achieve or to get or increase maximum conversions just within a few period or within the shortest period of time so they decided to stick with this style and they also decided to stick to this multiple navigation system 
at the end of this study which was done on the print globe website it was concluded that using multiple navigations really increase conversions for this website which is print globe so for print globe they use carousel they use the left navigation and also they use the grid so this is multiple navigations as one and this drastically increased conversions by 18.5 percent just within a short period of time so if this study really proves that using multiple navigations makes your website user friendly or makes your navigations friendly and automatically increases conversion then it is right or it is okay to follow in the footsteps of print globe for print globe it was carousel it was left navigation and it was great as well which is a combination of navigations as one you can also decide to try or add multiple navigations as one and see which one works better for you now let's quickly look at another website that is also practicing the same thing as print globe and that website is equally doing well so this website also uses less navigation the carousel and also the grid let's quickly look at that website this website right here is the Jumia website and Jumia has a left navigation which is right here and it also has a grid this is the grid right here and this is the carousel so i can decide to scroll through to see what is happening or to see what is in this list or what is in this category which is very good so multiple navigations first of all a navigation bar secondly a grid and also a carousel so if i click on fashion okay if i'm looking for something on fashion or if i'm looking for products on fashion it just gives me the result and right here i have all fashion in a grid so i can use the carousel to scroll through to search for whatever i am looking for and this makes things easier this makes things very very easy for your website visitors and also your web viewers with all the explanations the research and also the example i have just shown you you realize that using multiple navigation does not only make your navigation user friendly but also helps to increase conversion this is very important if you really want to increase conversion on your website now let's look at the second most important thing or the second thing you need to do to design a user-friendly navigation which also increases conversion as well let's look at that the second most important thing you need to consider if you want to design a user-friendly navigation which also increases conversion is to make sure that your navigation has a simple layout and a simple design once your layout is simple there is no confusion and your website users will know exactly where to go to look for a particular product and to take an action once your design is also very simple there is clarity and when there is clarity website users will know exactly what to do and it will increase conversions on your website automatically now there's a study to back this up and this study was conducted on the portland trailblazers website now the portland trailblazers website realized that they were doing very poor when it comes to conversions and they realized that the, the problem was coming from their layouts not only their layouts but also their design the design itself was very difficult to read and their layout was confusing so they decided to change things a little bit before we looked at what they did let's quickly look at the bad website design they did which really caused them or which really affected their conversions let's look at this this is the first navigation example of the portland trailblazers website and you can see that this design is not so good this navigation design is very poor first of all it has a transparent background and when you click on the drop down options it is very difficult to read whatever information that is in here and this is very confusing so the layout itself is confusing you don't know when you even select one particular item or when you select an item in the drop down option you cannot tell whether it has been selected or you cannot tell if what you're doing or whether you're taking the right action or not and because of this transparency background it is very difficult for you to see and this is a bad example of a navigation design and the layout was also not helping at all now let's quickly look at what they changed it to and how it helped them so this is what trailblazers decided to change their navigation to 
you realize that they removed the transparent background and aside removing the transparent background to make the text visible or to make their design readable they also aligned the drop down option vertically so there's a vertical layout presenting the pages in a more logical and easy flow this is a simple design and the layout in the vertical way is very simple and easy to read there's no confusion at all and once you select an item so once you select ticket it is going to give you an indication that this has been selected and it's going to show you that season ticket has also been selected this is a very simple design the layout is very smooth and easy and there's no difficulty or there's no confusion at all and when you design something like this or once your layout is simple and once your design is also very simple there is going to be clarity and once they, there's clarity your website visitors will take an action which will automatically increase conversion on your website when the trailblazers website changed the layout and the design of your navigation they realized that or the end result was that it increased revenue by 62.9 percent this is very large 62.9 percent revenue increase just by changing the design and the layout of your navigation so this is evidence that once your navigation has a simple layout and also a simple design your website visitors will be happy and once they're happy and they find your navigation very user friendly they are definitely going to take an action in your website which will help you increase conversions or increase revenue now let's quickly look at another website or an example of a website that has an easy layout and also easy design when it comes to navigation and that website is also doing very well when it comes to conversion and also revenue let's quickly look at that website this website right here is Virgin America and this is one of the website which has a simple layout and also a simple design and this website is just very easy for you to fall in love with this website and take any action at all so if I click on this drop down arrow it just gives me a variety of things under the about us it gives it gives you our story gives you timeline everything is just so simple the layout is just so smooth and neat there is no confusion at all and this is good you should be practicing something like this when it comes to navigation once your navigation has a simple layout and a simple design people would definitely take an action because there is clarity there is no confusion and this is going to help you increase conversion or increase revenue so this is just an example of a good website with simple layout and simple design so when i click on this it just sends you to the page and everything is just so smooth and simple so you should be practicing something like this if you really want to increase conversions on your website when it comes to navigation okay guys so with all these explanations with the studies and also the examples i have shown you for today i'm sure by now you know exactly what to do to design a user-friendly navigation which also will help you increase conversions on your website practice this and it's going to help you or it's going to go a long way to help you increase conversions on your website if you have learned something new and something interesting for today please do click on the subscribe button right below to subscribe to the channel and i promise to come your way with more educative content for you to learn something new thank you for subscribing to the channel and i will see you in the next tutorial